When we have a chance for thunderstorms in our area, and they could be strong to severe, we show you the Storm Prediction Center risk map, level one all the way to level five, with five being the highest. But depending on what color and what level you're in can be a big difference. So let's talk about that. This is the SPC map from March 25th, 2021. First of all, the light green areas, that's where no severe thunderstorms are expected. To get strong and severe thunderstorms, you need an abundant amount of lift, shear, which allows thunderstorms to tilt with height and be long lived, and finally spin in the atmosphere to support rotating thunderstorms. Level one, marginal means that a few thunderstorms could become strong that develop in that area. Level two is slight. This is when we have more ingredients for stronger storms. These storms are still short-lived and usually are not widespread. Level three is the enhanced risk. This is when we can see several severe storms within an area, and typically we do not see risks much higher than this here in Hampton Roads during our severe weather season. Level four is moderate risk. This is when severe weather is expected to be widespread. Large tornadoes are possible. Level five, or high risk, those are rare across the United States. We usually only see a handful of high risk days across the United States every year. When we see a high risk day, that's when the atmosphere ingredients all come together to create an explosive atmosphere. Widespread severe weather is expected on days like this. Long lived tornadoes are also possible. Several years ago, the Storm Prediction Center expanded to include five levels instead of three. They are also the agency who issues severe weather watches. Our local National Weather Service office issues the warnings. 